In today's video, I attempt the Milk Crate Challenge in Fortnite. But not only do I attempt the challenge, I also do 20 levels of milking fun. So if you enjoyed the video, be sure to subscribe. And without further ado, let's jump into it. I can't believe someone turned the Milk Crate TikTok challenge into a Fortnite death run. But here we are, here it is. Can we beat it? Jump across to find out. And we have fries. Okay, so that does make this a lot more difficult. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I've seen a lot of these TikTok challenges and they're, they're kind of funny sometimes. They're kind of funny, but it also seems really hard. And I have not done this in my life before. Oh my God, because I don't have this many milk crates. In fact, I have no milk crates. I don't know how these people are getting so many of them. Like, where do you buy them at? Can you buy them at Walmart? Because if you can, let me know. Maybe I'll do it in the future. Follow my TikTok, I don't know, but there we go. We nailed the milk crate challenge in Fortnite. I don't know what those TikTokers are on about, man. That was super easy. I quickly went ahead and respawned because I'm pretty sure we're not supposed to have the fry effect the entire way through. But in this little barn, we have people posting on TikTok. Nothing over here. I feel like there should be some names. I don't know. And we have the level selects. You know what we're going to do? We're going to be a little bit weird. I'm going to go from level 20 down to level one as opposed to the appropriate way to do it. So um, we're starting on what is technically the last level, but it's the first level for us. Just to really switch it up in case you guys are watching other videos. Yeah, we're doing it the other way around, which I think is a really cool way to do it. Seems pretty easy, I'm not gonna lie to you. Gotta watch out for short jumping. That is gonna be the biggest problem I could see. Oh goodness, oh it's, oh we short jumped, I caught it, I knew it was gonna happen. I think jump fatigue might be on because every time I jump more than two times in a row, I tend to fall. The furthest we have been, here we go. This is an incredibly long level. Oh, I went pretty far and I didn't short jump, so I think it is short jumping and not jump fatigue. Not a big deal, they're not a big deal. Come on, come on. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, there it is, gosh darn it. And now we're really initiating my fear of heights because holy moly, we're going really high up. Every jump seems to be a little easy though. Oh, I'm getting dizzy. You guys have heard it before in my videos. For some reason, my fear of heights translates into video games and I am literally freaking out right now. How high do you go? <laughs> Don't short jump, oh my God. It just keeps, it, it literally is spawning. Why did I choose to do level 20 as my first level? This was not a smart idea. I thought I was gonna be fun about it and it's just not fun. Okay, we're so close, we're so close, we're so close, we're so close. Don't look down, just don't look down. Easier said than done. Come on, come on. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's the end. And the point of this is that if you were playing through the entire map, you would now be done. So I think I need to go ahead and start on level one and then make my way back to here. Let's start on level one and then work our way back over there. <laughs> okay, that's that's the play. It's a cool way to end it though, I do like that. Just like on top, just staring above the peasants down here in the real world. It is pretty nice. And there's a barrier there, okay. I'm just happy we're done with level 20 because that was really initiating my fear of heights like that was that was insane and it was an incredibly long level right like that was super long nice there we go, there we go. uh what in the world do i do here oh i die there we go just two more jumps and we call it a day oh my god we just went for it we literally went for it and there we go level two this one is just impulsing Thank you for switching it up and not being the same thing all over the place. Oh, it's so easy. I'm loving it, man. I'm loving it. Boom. Level three. What do you got for us? Oh, God. What in the heck am I doing? Serious speed. Serious speed is serious, but we nail it first try. There we go, man. Oh, I forgot the jump fatigue. I don't understand why that's on. But again, it makes it more challenging. Although I hate any map that has jump fatigue because it's a horrible setting and it should be removed from Fortnite in general. Okay, that's, that's my stance. Hashtag remove jump fatigue. Am I right? I think I'm right. This is definitely really, really easy though. The, uh, the milk crates are rather thick, like the skin I'm wearing. There we go, level something I don't even know. 
I think five, right? I want to say five. I'm not too sure, but this seems to be. Why is it a repeat of the last level? Which in reality would mean level 20 is a repeat of this. How far will I go? How far? Over 500 plus players in the first 24 hours. Nice. Well done. Well done. All right, just about done. Oh, we're good. Oh, fantastic. That was not that bad. And we're impulsing. Yes. Literally make the rest of this impulsing and I will just be speed. Let's get a bit of a last second jump. There we go. I'm just going to last second all of these, assuming I have to. Yep, I think you might. One more. How do I have four more? I don't even know. But either way, almost went too far. There we go. Oh, this one feels like an easier version of level 20. It starts you by climbing, which I don't like. I really, really don't like. Who oh, got? And we died. There we go. Make it all the way up. And then big jump all the way down. Oh, we landed. Oh my goodness, that was terrifying. That's like the world's scariest dropper because you have so much work to do if you die right there. Um, we're actually pretty close. We're definitely really, really close to the end already, which is great. Again, this feels like just a super, super simplified version of level 20. We're going all the way up, just a few more jumps. And we're in that rift. We're in there like swimwear, baby. Check this out, check this out. Yeet! Perfect, there we go. Am I landing in the middle? Oh, I am. I only have so many impulses to work with though. Woo, baby, okay. We don't even need all of them. We have one remaining. That's how cracked we are with the impulse, ladies. Oh, we got more fries, I forgot about that. I forgot speed levels were a thing in this map. Yeet. Ooh, God, okay. There we go, that's clean, that's clean. Oh, that's good. A little short jump out of the way as well. And that is such a far jump. Oh, baby. Oh, my God. The short jump actually might have saved our life in that instance, which that's something you don't see every day. Now, we're going to have to unfortunately die here just because the fries don't get taken away from you. So you got to do it yourself. There we go. And we have more impulsing levels, which again, I'm just I'm a big fan of. I love me some impulses. I'm the Impulse King, as we all know. Oh my goodness, I'm going flying through this. Ooh, almost, almost missed it. Here we go. Big jump for big prizes. Oh, look at that flawless. I went too far. I had to hold S during that jump. Holy moly. And I mean, we could just make that. Let's save an Impulse, baby. There we go. And more impulses. Oh my goodness. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, excuse me? I don't have the impulses necessary to beat this level. Oh, you're supposed to get nine? How did I get like five? Wait a minute. The random amount of impulses. What a troll. Yeah, now we have plenty of impulses remaining. <laughs> we can mess up and still be good, but there we go. Uh, knocking it out and we have probably more speed. There's no way that's speed. Yeah, that would be impossible with speed. This is a really, really simple level. I'm liking it though. It's not the same, which is good. It's different, which is my kind of level. There we go. I have no idea what level I'm on, but it's gotta be like close to 20, right? The second we see level 20 again, we're done because we already beat that level because of my weird choices I've made in life. I don't know why I did that, but it's working out in a great way. And we've leveled up for our sacrifices. Nice, good job, good job. Uh, what are we doing here? I feel like I'm going up a roller coaster right now. Oh, we are going down a roller coaster at this point. Oh my goodness, okay. Now this, this is a level that I definitely signed on for. This is a fun one. Oh God, the short jumping is not fun. However, can we do it? Oh, we can do it. Oh my God, I thought we were gonna short jump right there at the end. But nice, fantabulous. These seem like some thick boy Neo, so it might be a little challenging. But as we are the Impulse King, we are also the Neo King. Now again, unfortunately with the short jumping or jump fatigue, I can't do this uh, quickly. So it's not gonna be as cool looking as you'd normally expect. But uh, it's 
Ooh, close one. It touched me a little bit there. I don't love that. Do not love that. A few of these seem to poke out a little bit more than the others. But uh, there we go. Simple, easy, we're good to go. And now some crash padding. Interesting stuff, interesting stuff. Oh god, oh god, no! I, I went so far! There's gotta be a crash pad that I missed on the crates themselves. No, maybe I have to use that crash pad to go all the way to the end. Hold W and hope for the best! Ooh. I died. What if I hit the target? No. Oh! You can jump in the water if you time it. I'm gonna take that as a dub. Okay, <laughs> that's that's something else. That's something else. Uh, where are we going? We're going to the blue one. I'm liking the addition of the crash pads. It really brings a new element into play, which I like a lot. Oh! I if you walk into it, it seems to send you with the perfect angle. That's actually good to know. That's really, really good to know. And then this is the last one. Last one right here, baby, come on. Nice, we have to be close to 20. We have to be so close. Oh, I thought that was it, I really did. All right, back to jumping through the milk crates. So I'm gonna take this left path. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Could you take the right side path? Because that seems way, way too easy. There's no way you can do this, right? Nope. Yeet! Oh boy! Yep, you know, sometimes in life, you gotta make it work. I'm hoping nine is enough, right? Yeah, I would, I would think nine is enough. There we go, fantastic. And here we are, we are on level 20, so that means we have completed the map. There's no GG room, I guess, but that kind of makes sense. You probably just go back to the exit, and you go back to the beginning right here. So, guys, if you enjoyed, definitely drop a like, subscribe, and of course, share this video around. You can do the Milk Crate Challenge in Fortnite, which is something very interesting. But uh, other than that, that's all we have for the video, so I will talk to you all later. Have a nice day, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Deep dab, and peace out.